Today is a really interesting video. I'm actually going to be going over everything you guys need to see my journey. So we're going to be going over, you know, my age, um, how heavy I was at this age, you know, how tall I was at this age, um, and you know, maybe my my maxes, my PRs. We're going to go over all of that. This is the ultimate video to track my progress and to see exactly how I've been looking and what I've been doing throughout my whole workout journey. So I wanted to throw this together for Greg Doucette. Hopefully he's watching this. Hopefully he makes a Natty or Not video on me. That would be awesome. So you guys know, at least for me personally, not that everyone's gonna believe me, I am 100% natural. Uh, I've only taken creatine, BCAs, uh, glutamine, creatine, HCL. Uh, I don't take HCL, creatine anymore, just the monohydrate. Uh, Pre-workout, I, I don't know if I already said that, but anyways, those are the only things I've ever taken my entire life. Hopefully, Greg comes up with the same conclusion. We're going to go through all of it, and actually, there's going to be some footage you guys have never seen before from when I was 14 years old, and I think a picture from when I was 12 as well. All right, guys, getting into the video, throwing an absolute laser to first base, I assume. I wasn't 12 there, but I am 12 right here. That's the start of my lifting journey. Uh, 14 there. I was not 178. I'm not exactly sure how heavy I was there. Um, but I do know in these pictures right now that you're seeing, I was 178. While I was 16, I creeped into the 180s, almost into the 190s. While I was uh, real, going back on a, another note, my bench press is 12, 155 max, 13, 185 max. 14, I hit 225 for one. Um, of course, all these are for one rep. All these pictures you're seeing, 16, 16 years old, getting into the 180s. All right, back to the bench maxes. When I was 16, I hit, um, I think I hit 315, 17, 18, 19, stayed around 315. Plateaued pretty hard there. All right, guys, here I am, 16 years old, looking lean as ever, like I always was. Um, just a really fast metabolism, like you guys know. I have to eat a lot of food. Also, I did a lot of cardio, or a good amount of cardio back in the day with sports and whatnot. Played football, golf, baseball. Um, I was a really avid rock climber. I was rock climbing all throughout these pictures here, as well as lifting. All right, here is 315 squat max at 16. By the way, these were my maxes at 15. I just turned 16 in these videos. Uh, my squat maxes, I couldn't really tell you the ages for, but... 275 at uh, 15. I just turned 16 in this, but I did bench 285 while I was 15. All right, little parkour there. Used to do parkour, kind of how I was looking. Normal kid running around doing my thing. Here's a parkour video, and you know these videos. It's a kind of it's kind of for a, a kind of a little glimpse into how I looked, how I kind of moved. Um, you know, pretty functional. Looked pretty much like a muscular kid there, you know, not like massive. Uh, 16 years old, doing more parkour. Super into parkour. Did I did uh, American Ninja Warrior competitions. Uh, I never competed in rock climbing, but here I am doing something called a campus dyno. It's a rock climbing exercise to help build explosion. For you guys that know ratings, um, I climbed a V9 was my highest boulder rating. Uh, one probably 185 pounds when I climbed that V9. Here's some more parkour. Just doing my thing. That is called a Kong to precision into a front flip, for you guys that know. All right, muscle ups. I think I did maybe 12 here. My all-time record was 16. Again, I am also 16 years old, still in these clips. I'm just cranking them out. Uh, super. I was super into um body weight training, uh, even through, you know, 16. Um, I started going to the gym when I was 12, and then I backed off a little bit, but I kept lifting at home. Um, so anyways, here's a little Ninja Warrior competition that I won. Got a slack line, that was kind of cool. Um, I don't remember, I still have that t-shirt, it's kind of funny, I got like a large, I was swimming in it back then. Um, as you can tell, oh, here's another uh, camp, this is just called campusing, just using your arms, I guess I put my feet on the wall there, but that was a V7, uh, 181, as you guys can see, 16 years old there, 
180 pounds. I'm doing some heavy bicep curls. Again, my curling strength was pretty high for my age, just due to all the rock climbing and forearm building that I did. 185, also 16 there. So looking pretty lean before I knew how to get an actual angle on a photo. Uh, doing Spartan races. For you guys that didn't know why I compete in Spartan races, or at least I did. Um, went to the World Championship and I believe 2017 in Canada. Placed 8th for teen uh, males. A little more parkour there. Boom, got off the wall. So fast. No, I'm just kidding, guys. All right, as you guys can still see here, 16, getting older, almost 17, but still as lean. Here's a cool little clip I thought you guys might be interested in. This was a world championship Spartan rig that uh, if you touch the ground once, they cut your bracelet, and then you can't place once you finish. If, say, you finish top, whatever. If you touch the ground one time, you can't place. So here, this is not the actual race. Um... But this stuff was a breeze for me, uh, just due to rock climbing, core, um, my core was super strong, super easy to keep my legs up, this is kind of, you know, this is all part of my fitness journey, so I hope you guys aren't too bored at these videos, but uh, doing some heel hooks, I had to jump to this wobbly weird grip. Boom, nailed it, and then you gotta put your foot back in that. Toe hook, maybe. Heel hook. I think I'm going for the heel. There it is. And then uh, you grab the last thing and swing over. And, and I did make it, by the way. So don't you think I didn't. Alright. Uh, 16, still. Um, just breaking into the squat. Which I started at 15. I started squatting heavy at 15. Or whatever you think this is. Uh, six reps I was able to get. This was just a few months into squatting because actually my uh, beginner gains in squat, and as you guys will be able to see later, or I don't, I don't think you guys saw the picture of my legs yet when I was 16, but uh, that was a genetic strong point for me is my uh, my legs. I guess my quads. Well, I've heard quads and hamstrings from uh, people before. Um, so anyways, that is a genetic strong point there. Uh, all right. Three plates. There it is. All right. I was starting to really grow at 16. Uh, I played football in high school a little bit. Long story there, not going to get into it. Didn't finish, only played one year. That is called a dino. Doing my little nerdy face. Alright, this is a V7 for you guys that know about climbing and you know what that is. These little grips I'm grabbing onto are super tiny. That's a r extreme slope hold right there. And right now what I'm holding on to is like this, the size of a uh, a door frame that I have to pull up and jump off of um, and then boom stick it on the outside of the wall toe hook on the left and boom grab the finish hold you got to get two hands on it to finish and there it is so there I was about a uh, 198 but we're gonna jump ahead real soon there my legs are first time I showed my legs I do remember that picture was taken at 16. I, I hope you guys appreciate all the, uh, the different pictures that I got. Alright, 17. We're 17 here. Uh, I was 193 in that photo. That's kind of cool. I'm happy I tracked that. Um, and I did break 200 when I was 17. So here is 17 years old. Physique updates here. Uh, let's see, 17. My bench was 325. As well as a 460 squat. Now I'm 18 um, in these photos. Back's looking pretty good in that one, actually. Uh, yeah, 18 here. That uh, Now, I look really small there. That was a teen national. All of these right here that you guys are seeing, super lean. That was the prep for teen nationals in 2018 that I won classic physique in. Uh, here we go. Oh, this is 17 here. 505 deadlift was my max, 455 squat was my max at 17, um, and then 460 was my max at uh, 18. I think I got that mixed up before. Super close though, so I mean. Um, and then I ended up hurting my back a little later, so I wasn't able, I haven't squatted up there yet, even now. I'm 21 currently. I weigh about 208, which you guys are going to see later. All right, 
Moving into 19 years old physique updates here. Showing the back a little bit. 19 years old. Bench was around the same. Squat was about the same. Those are my legs. 2018 was the first time I benched. Um, now I think I got... That's just a random clip at 315. Alright, here's my 460 squat at 18. Currently 5'11 is my height. Boom, got it. Alright, this was 20 years old now. Moving into 20 years old. 315 for I think 6. A couple of pause wraps at the end there. Hit 365 that day, but for some reason that clip doesn't want to load for this video. I'm having trouble with my uh, editing. So, uh, yep, there it is, 20 years old. Little physique up there, doing some flexing. Same there. This is a very current video, so now we're up to current uh, time. You guys can look at other pictures on my Instagram if you want the exact physique that I have right now. 208, and this is what I look like, just doing my thing. You know, I look, this is what you guys gotta remember, like, when you guys see my Instagram photos, when you guys see my Instagram photos, that's lighting, that's a pump, that's all of it. This is what I look like day to day, doing my thing. I love to golf, golfing here. And that that's going to be it. That's going to be the video. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think. I hope, you know, Greg do set more plays, more dates. Hope you guys review it. Give me a little more uh, engagement, a little more exposure. So, yeah, I hope that was a really good summary. Uh, I've got a bunch of pictures for you guys there. How I've looked over the years. Again, you guys, uh, I believe I already uh, talked about all the supplements that I've used. I've always eaten like a bodybuilder. Um, my entire life. That's a really big part you guys got to remember. A lot of things were in line. I had a lot of building blocks. Um, I used to always eat a ton, as much as I could. Even when I was in elementary school, I'd always double up on the school lunch. That's just how I've always been, because I love to eat. And since my metabolism is just so fast, when I do gain weight, it's always lean. Lean muscle. So that's why I'm lean year-round. I literally cannot get fluffy even if I try. I've been trying. I've had weeks where I eat pizza, cheesecake, cereal, all of the above, um, and I cannot get over 12% body fat. Now, um, if you guys think in some of those pictures I already am, uh, I don't know exactly my body fat percentage, but I'm not any higher than what you guys have already seen in my YouTube. I've never gotten higher than that, and that's me um, really trying to get you know as big as possible. So... There it is. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you guys made it to this point, thank you so much. I really appreciate everyone that makes it through these videos and comments. And uh, I see a lot of you guys saying people in the comments every video. That really means the world to me. So thank you guys for the support. And I will see you in the next one.